I'm going to play without having to make a lot of comments. show you a little slow blues slightly advanced just slightly advanced I make a C7 chord okay and then I play the blues over it but I'm going to modify it that's nothing but the C blues and notice I go like that I don't think of classical music which you uh, I don't have to worry about where the thumb is here or whatever and that's a rule like you, there's certain things in classical you just don't do. And it, it, with uh, blues, you're able to break those rules all the time. Okay, now this is slow blues. Da, 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 da. Uh, and that's a C7. Now I move it here, this is an F7. Da, that's an F, A, C, E flat. Now you've got all these choices without even going to the blue scales, because this here's the blue scale for F, okay, which you won't like. Nah, won't even work. You kind of want to stay right around that C blues. That's the C, E flat, F, G flat, G, and that is a one, the, the flat three, the four, the flat five, and the five. And this is a flat seven. Now you're gonna go, now the four chord again. Now you wanna use, oh, you wanna use the notes, and you're like a little, maybe a little passing note or something. Now what I like to use is here is an A, C, D, E flat. Back to C. Now, go, now don't try to do that. Now what I like to do is this. Now that's another thing that's a little bit advanced, but it is a G, A, B flat, B. just loads and loads of stuff you do. And then now the fourth chord, which is the F7. Now notice as I'm doing the F, A, C, E flat, and also I've got A, C, E flat, F, which is another form or inversion of F7. Now I'm going to go to, to the one, which is a C7. Now what I like to do is I like to go I like to take the third here and the flat seven here and walk them up independently. This walks up, this walks down. And then I go to the four chord, the five chord. And I'm gonna play without having to make a lot of comments.
Now I'm going to five chord. And I really like to go down like this. Put your hand like this. B, D, G. And keep your hand locked. And in both, now you're going to go with F7. Or just the root. You'll find out that you like to do this. All I'm doing right here is coming down in almost an arpeggio way. I go back to that D. Now that's just a, a, one of these kinds of things from classical music. But anyways, it's nothing but an arpeggio. I say nothing but. It just takes a while to learn it. This is not really all the way for beginners. It's kind of like late, late beginners. That's a 13th. It's got the A, the B flat, the E. It's got the root here. Let's count them up. One, flat seven. That right there is a tenth or a third. And there's a sixth. It has a certain sound to it. I just like it, the sound. Now I've got that. Uh, you want to do that. You want to get used to that thumb on A. Okay, I'm just showing you what uh, I've learned over the years, and I think a lot of other pianists do it because it's just something that we gravitated toward. I'm largely self-taught. Okay, even though I took classical music and everything, I'm largely self-taught. And I used to stress about, you know, when I would do certain things, uh, you that have taken some classical music, uh, you you stress about, well, I, well my, I, do I, you know, don't worry about it. Blues should break all the rules. It's like jazz. I did a... Da, 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 da. Now, a very common thing to do in, in blues or any kind of like this type of music or, uh, or um, especially popular music is a 5 6 1. Okay? You're almost in a feeling of like a major pentatonic. And then a lot of times what I'll do is I'll go. Da, 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 da. That's that flat seven. It's just got that sound. Now you're going to go to the four chord, but in the four chord, which is an F, you're going to go to the flat seven. Just want another way to do it. Now you're going to want to play the notes something like A, C, D, E flat. And then you get on the root again. This is just loads of different ways to do this. I just give an example of how to do it. Now I'm going to go to the, the five chord. Now I want to hit either a G, a B, or a D, or an F, and maybe an E. 